believe me, I like Sexy Red. I even did a previous video about Sexy Red and I said that she was gonna blow up. Y'all know I always champion authenticity and Sexy Red, her name would be right next to authenticity in the dictionary. But this new lip gloss line brand that she came out with and these names, this could have been executed better. I know that Sexy Red is very raunchy and very explicit, but I feel like there is a difference between raunchy, explicit, and very just like downright nasty. Now, I can see people buying this just to put out a reaction of the lip gloss on their social media because that's where we are nowadays, right? But I'm genuinely wondering if this is Sexy Red's era but what is the longevity in Sexy Red? Because this could have went about a whole nother way. Another one of my marketing peers definitely made a good point today where she said that Sexy Red could definitely turn around her brand, brand to talk about sex positivity to get to a bigger bag. You can still be raunchy and still be authentic and still talk about positive things and get to a bigger bag. Sexy Red also gives me the vibes that she is genuinely a nice person so it wouldn't be far off if she was talking about sex positivity and get to a bigger bag in a different way than this this seems like it's for the moment it's going to be talked about it's for an era but once everybody gets tired of it and it gets burnt out then what is what i'm asking myself honestly